Hey guys, it's Bettina Gal, and we are back over in Glacial Awakening on Minecraft. And uh, I did a bit of stuff in between. We'll go over that and then uh, see what we can get done today. So, um, I did have this stuff, and I went ahead. Let's get this stuff out real quick. My inventory is super full. I'm just going to put some of this back in here. I went ahead and made an iron rock grinder for what I did in between episodes. I was trying to get more gravel, so I just used the rock grinder and uh, cobblestone to get that. I went ahead and removed the dirt, and I also put the um, strainer base back in. So we've got more of the bone shards and stone dust, and we need stone dust. Don't really need granite or flint, but it's, I figured it was an easier way. You know, it's just automatically giving you that stuff, so it's, uh, it's pretty good. So, yeah, we'll see what we can do with that. So, I think, um, let's see. And I went ahead and got more redstone and blaze powder and all that fun stuff. So, I was going to show you that real quick. Let's do that. So I went ahead and changed this to glass, and I just uh, put the dropper back. So what I did was if you put, uh, I'll go ahead and put three, because we'll need two later. And we'll need two blaze powder. So uh, let's see if this is going to work. So I put a button here. So we have the gunpowder. Oh, the button broke. <laughs> So, uh, what happened was, I tried to make a diamond ore here and then use the, um, the grit vase to break it. Well, the, it only broke it and, and gave me one diamond, uh, so I was like, yeah, that's not gonna work. So, if we look in here, um, I'm just gonna put this in for a second. Don't know if that's gonna be enough, actually. There we go. So that gives us two blaze powder. And we'll probably have to... Yeah, we're going to have to get some more stuff. Uh, let's see that. I'll just take this out. I mean, we got plenty of wood. I'm not really worried about using a different fuel source. Uh, I'm sure there's better ones than wood, but, you know, like I said, we got plenty of it. So, So if I go ahead and click this four times that'll put in the two blaze powder and two uh gun powder and there we go we got 16 redstone so that's what i did in between i just got a bunch of that and i'll go ahead and take this back out okay so we got that and um that was super because I, I was trying to figure out an easier way to make um redstone and i was like oh that's simple Okay, um, let's go ahead and put this back in here, and I hear that spider out there, but I also, um, went ahead and planted our nether wart here, and, um, it's, it's going pretty good, and then went ahead and uh, made this little area here for trees. So we've got the dark oak, birch, and jungle uh, trees here growing, which is super cool. I could probably expand it to also uh, have some oak trees, but for now, that's what we got okay. going. But we can so, also yeah. use this um, uh, vice, so we can have stuff in our chest and still use it. The only problem with that is we have to... Um... Oh, whoa, what? what? Oh, <laughs> it's like, what am I doing? Uh, it only does one at a time, so you can't do, you know, multiple and things, crush I want two to... of them. There we go. And that will get us the soul dust we need. Super cool. I don't know how far away this vice actually works. Let's see. So, this is what we needed, and we need to make that. That, Okay. Yay, we got so raw soul steel. Awesome. Okay, and then do we need to put that in the furnace? Yeah. Okay. So, let's do that real quick. And I know there's other furnaces that we started with, but this is just so much easier. 
Um, let me know. I mean, there's probably some kind of a um, advantage to using it, but it's just so much easier to use this. So I'm like, no, we'll just use this. So now we have a displacer. And now we can actually get the diamond or off the ground uh, when we make it. So let's see. Um, I don't think I have any sentient cores made. Let's see if we can do that. Ah, oh, we need glowstone. And uh, we'll go over here. So this one. Um, so we need to make this, uh, which is a bottled ghost. Um, I did another bottled sunlight and that's just getting the, um, I think is is a cork and bottle. Let's see. Or bottle and cork. I don't remember. Um, let's see. Is that cork? There we go. Bottle and cork. Uh, so I'm not going to, I'm not going to bookmark this. It's, it's easy. So we need a plank and a bottle and the bottle is obviously just the three glass. Is there another way to make it or is that it? I think that's it. Okay. So I made some of those. So we've got that and we've got this one. So we need to make the, um, infused iron, which is made on the altar. And then a diamond. Uh, so, yeah, we can do that pretty easily, I think. Go. So I went ahead and put a chest with a hopper. And then there's a hopper and a chest down at the bottom as well. So we can just put our ingots in here. And then they will um, get finished and go down into our chest down here. Which is super cool. There we go. Got... Three, four, and five. So let's go here, and we've got this right there. Awesome. So we need the, this one. We need the crushed netherrack. Okay, so that's why I have netherrack on me. So let's just put a couple of these down, and we'll use our rock grinder. There we go. That will get us what we need. Super cool. Alright. And then that. And that. Awesome. Got ourselves bottled ghost. <laughs> um, oh, I think I think I need another bottled sunlight. So stop picking up stuff. So let's go ahead and get another bottled sunlight. Really need to empty my inventory. Uh, spooky, scary skeleton. Wait, what? Okay. I guess that was from the bottled ghost. Uh, is it daytime? <laughs> Let's see. There we go. Awesome. Okay. So, uh, let's do that. I heard that spider fall and it scared me, but then I realized he can't get through the door. So, we're good. All right, so we've got that one. Now we need this one. That will get us, no? Um, why not? Uh, diamond, bottle of ghost, bottle of sunlight, and piece of iron. Um, why is that not giving me the thing? Okay, let's uh, not use that. Let's get into this crafting table. And do that. There we go. Okay, whatever. Got that. Super cool. Quest complete. I like completing quests. Okay, so we got that, which gives us a soul steel sword. Uh, access to the minute. Okay. All right, so we got a soul steel sword. I'm not exactly sure why we why we're gonna need it, but we we got it. Okay, so let's try. I guess I won't use my other thing because it doesn't seem to be working. 
Uh, oh, yeah. Glowstone. Let's go get some more of the imprisoned light here. Oh, man. There's only one that's done. So I was going to say, is that done? I don't know. Uh, yeah, like I said. Oh, I need to put this down. I can do that. Okay. Really need to empty out my inventory. I know you guys are probably really tired of hearing me say that. <laughs> okay. Let's see if we can crush this. Oh, but that's not going to give us enough because we only have two. Okay. Well, let me try to get that and then I will be back. Okay, we're back. And I got the sentient cores we needed and uh, put the root of life, I think it is, right? Yeah, root of life shard on there. And uh, so we're going to get some diamond and then we're going to test out our empowered displacer. So if we right click and hold... There you go. We got a diamond ore. Awesome. So I don't know if there's something we can do um, to get more ore out of this. Okay, we already got it. All right. So, uh, yeah, we got our ore here. Um, and that will give us that. Which will give us another diamond ore. Okay. Super cool. And then now we need... A weeping block and two tokens of sorrow that doesn't sound good at all right so let's see for weeping block we need more sentient chorus and a red nether brick okay so we got another wart um, we can just uh, smelt the nether rack and get the brick so that's what we'll do uh, do we have that? No, we don't. I, I cleaned out my inventory, so of course now we need everything. But that's the way it happens. It's always the way it happens, right? So we need the nether rack. Uh, is it in here? No. I didn't use it all, right? I, I didn't think I did. Uh, oh, there it is. It's like, I know it's got to be here somewhere. All right, there we go. And um, was there something else we needed? Probably, but let's go put this in the furnace real quick. And uh, oh, I don't know if I want to do all of it. Let's just do a couple. That's all we need for this recipe at least. And we will get that done. And hopefully, uh, get the next thing done. Um, I don't need, oops, I don't need this or that or that or that. I mean, after I delete them, I probably need them, but it's fine. Okay. So let's take that one. And this is for the weeping block, right? So let's see. Uh, first, we're going to need... Ah, oh, we're going to need more uh, glowstone. Because <laughs> we need more sentient cores. I shouldn't have used them all. Because uh, I don't think... Okay. Wait, do we not have any lapis either? What's going on? Oops. I thought we had lapis, but maybe we used it all. I guess we used it all. Okay. Alright, so... Man, I wish I hadn't used those all of those. Um, let's see. Lapis was right here. And... Get that... We need a verdant core and prismarine. I don't think we have prismarine. Okay. <laughs> didn't we make didn't we make lapis one time? Well, I mean, I know we made it. Let's see. 
Let's look at that again. Because I know we've gotten it before. Because obviously we, we had it. Uh, Lapis. Let's see. Or did we actually find it? Did we actually find it in the world? Maybe we did. Okay. All right. So let's let's go down real quick. Um, oops. Just totally did a circle. But that's fine. So if I use the displacer, yay! I can actually pick it up. Awesome. I totally forgot that I even made it. <laughs> okay, so there we go. Um, let's look then, because we may be able to make a verdant core then. Maybe. I'm not uh, promising anything, but... Verdant core. Let's go ahead and do this. Okay. So we need... Imprison light, turf block, and seeds. What are turf blocks? Dirt with a shard of pure giver. Okay. Oh, uh, we don't... Oh, wow. It goes that far. Okay. Cool. And that gives us four of... Awesome. Super cool. Okay. So, for the lapis, I'm guessing we need to use a... Um, a blue shard? <laughs> what was that? Pure was that pure giver or was it something else? This a uh, root of life. Okay. Oh, but no, that was for this one, wasn't it? Okay. So we need to use pure giver for that. Awesome. Okay. My dog is being so loud. He is snoring away down back in on my bed. He is so out of it. Okay, let's use... Uh, we don't need those yet. Pure giver is what we need. See, I cleaned out my inventory and now it's like super full again. I don't know. Alright. So, let's go ahead. I, I guess I could have slept first, but oh well. It's fine. So, we'll go ahead and make these. Oops, not that. And uh, we'll put the, nope, not that one. Put the pure giver on top. And let's put the ice in the middle, which hopefully won't melt. I think, I mean, there's a, there's a torch up, up here, right there. Go ahead and break that just in case. All right, there we go. Of course, now we have to make more verdant cores, but that's okay. Oh my gosh, it's so noisy out there. Cool. And that will get us the prismarine. Awesome. But I will pick this up with the displacer. I don't want to, I don't want to make it melt. Okay, let's put that. Nope. There we go. Okay, so we got that one. Uh, can we make more verdant cores? That is the question. Uh, so loud, guys. So loud. All right. Uh, okay. That may be an issue. That. So we need lapis to make verdant cores. Oh my goodness, that is so annoying. I thought I had it. I was like, okay, we can do it this way. Uh, let's see. Any other way that I'm not thinking of? What was the uh, lapis block? See, there we go. We need to make rock cores with the root of life and sand. Okay. But I hope you guys have enjoyed the episode. If you have, definitely hit that thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel or haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified of videos as they come out. 
And if you want to play this pack or check out any of my social media or Patreon links, they're all down below in the description. So check those out and come over and have some fun over there. And if you have any questions, comments, tips, anything like that, definitely leave those down below in the comment section. I love seeing those and we'll get back with you as soon as I can. And until next time, I hope you have a super blessed day. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye guys!